Okay, so this is when you first walk in and it's kind of just an overview of my room. It's a closet. And yeah, it's pretty, it's a small space, but like definitely big for a room in college. Okay, sorry about the glare. It's the light. So we're gonna make a glare on this portion of the room. But right when you walk in from the door, I have this little sign that says keys and that pretty much has all my masks. I have my skin mask, mask that I have from Target, my school mask, and then also my keys um and kind of like cards and stuff that i just bring around then over here i just have like this little gallery wall that i printed out from pinterest um i have like some at home but i wanted just to keep like a little nice thing around my wall to give some decor um i you guys could tell i really like the fashion stuff here but i have that in front of my desk so where you guys could see me in that little circle mirror. Also for my desk, I got this desk on Amazon for very cheap. I mean, it's kind of wobbly, but like it does the work. Um, and I think they have it also like in brown, but I got it in black. So right over here, I just kind of keep all like my books, my journals, uh, books that I'm reading right now, books from school, note cards, um, my glasses. And over here I have my Apple Watch that I just have connected to my laptop, my planner, my regular glasses, um, another planner, like notebook for my one of my organizations. Then I have like a little coaster over here, so whenever I drink stuff, and then all my pens that is just in this little cup holder. May your dreams, may your day be as flawless as your makeup. And then I just have like you can do this. And then also this lamp, but it broke like last week. I mean, it still works, but it's just, she kind of broke him. And then next I just have my iPad over here because I'm always working on my iPad. And then as well as my laptop. Down below I have like all these cords that I just kind of like push back because obviously no one sees it, but I just have like an extension cord to connect all my chargers. Also this mirror I got on Amazon as well. Um, and I'll try to find the link for this, but I got this also for like $35, which these mirrors are tend to be very a little bit pricier, but I got black, figured out it was a good deal. I was hanging it up, but since like when you're renting an apartment, you guys saw my photo fall, but when you rent an apartment, you can't put holes in the wall. So I was like using command strips and it fell. Luckily it didn't break, so I felt like I should just put it against my desk. Also, this chair, um, it was my mom's. I'm not sure where she got it. I think she might have gotten this at Target, though. Because I remember when I was looking for a chair when I was at home for the semester, um, she said Target, but there wasn't any anymore. So I believe this is from Target, but I'm not quite sure. And then around the corner, I just have, like, my backpack I use when I go to campus. Sometimes I use just, like, a little tote bag. Now, over here, I just kind of have, like, a little organizer for, like, a lot of my stuff because since I only have like a closet, like all my regular clothes, socks, um, athletic stuff, hair, makeup stuff, all just kind of like fit here, which was perfect. And all of this organizers are cube organizers is from Target as well as the bin. And they're pretty spacious. I'm like, I mean, I kind of threw all of my hair stuff and some skincare stuff in here, but they're very like chunky and spacious. Um, I know I have a candle up here. Yes, it's, it's like Christmas. Um, so going through candles and I just get my lighter and I have my Google home over here. And then this little battery box that goes with a, like a lighting cord, which I'll show later. Um, then I have a TV right here. I did not get the cable for it yet. So I literally have not used it at all all semester, which is kind of good because I can't focus if I watch TV all the time. Then over here, I have my skincare fridge, which I went in about on my nighttime skincare routine. So if you want to see that, go ahead, check that out. Then I have some like miscellaneous stuff in here. I have socks and other stuff in here. Here, I just have like t-shirts and like pajama stuff. Athletic wear in here. And then pretty much all of my makeup, beauty, tanning, some jewelry all in there. So with that little lighting cable, 
connects to this little flower thing. I'm pretty sure I got this all from Five and Below. I just have it connected right here just to give a cute decor. So just kind of like an angle. And then I have my 21st birthday um, kind of little belt thing. I don't remember what the word's called. And I just thought it was just kind of like a cute place to hang up here. And then over here, I have like a little small body mirror. I mean, it does the job. You can see my whole outfit and whatever. But um, I was going to bring my larger mirror, but it just did not fit in any of our cars. So this was going to do. And then I have a picture of me and my boyfriend from prom my junior year. And then I just have this little rug that I got from Marshalls. But I'm pretty sure I was it. They put it in the washer. And it was like a weird texture. And then this stand I have. It's like a little basket. But for me to prop this mirror, I just put it on there, which it works. So you guys can see full body and whatnot. Then over here, I just, I actually just recently just added this like last night. It's like a Polaroid wall. I mean, there's not a lot. If you guys know how to stick Polaroids that won't fall because I added tape and they just keep falling. Like, see, like this just doesn't stay. I mean, obviously I'm going to have this for like three more weeks. But I just hate that it keeps falling. Now over here off to the side that's like by my mirror is this cart that I also got from Target. Target comes in clutch when you're trying to like decorate everything. But I figure next semester when I go to DC it just can come in handy for like all my skincare, hair care, and pretty much everything. But on the first thing, ignore my dirty mirror, but there I am again. It's just like a little selfie mirror that I use to um, do my makeup in. I then have this little cute flower tray that I found at Goodwill to hold my jewelry. This actually goes down there. Then I just have like a wax and stuff that normally goes in there, but it's like pretty full right now. Um, have my perfume, beauty blender, hand sanitizer, body spray, some nail polish that I brought from home, some like foot lotion, body spray, and then all my dirty brushes that I still need to clean. Then on the next level, it's kind of more of miscellaneous camera stuff, just like random stuff I don't have storage for. Um, like I have my Polaroid, I have my essential oil for my diffuser bag, my Nespresso like capsule bag, have a thread up bag in case of clothes I want to sell, some books there, and then like a command hook. And then lastly, I've been getting into painting a lot, and so I just have all like my craft stuff. Uh, and also journaling because I journal all the time as well. So I just have that all right here. Okay, over here by my window, I just have this photo of my boyfriend and I in prom again. Um, and then this sunflower pot that I'm growing. I don't even know if it's growing, to be honest, but I made that pot. And then <laughs> these are the tulips that I got in my, I don't know if you guys see it because of light, in my Trader Joe's haul. And I left for the weekend and they're just kind of dying. So that's unfortunate, but... I'm going to keep them until they're fully dead. Okay, I turned up the brightness so you guys can see it a little bit better. But yeah, that's pretty much what I have over by my window. Not much here. I just kind of like have like a, like a miniature roof deck, but you can't even go out there. But yeah. Now over here is like my gallery wall. Um, ignore that. The last person that was here left it here and literally ripped the wall. So that's something that they're going to have to fix. But I got these at Dollar Tree, which is so cool. And so I just have a picture of my friend and I from our senior prom. I have a lot of pictures of prom. Uh, my disposable camera that I'm almost done, that's so I need to develop. Um, this 21 birthday cup that I got for my birthday as a gift. And then as well as these cute sunglasses. Then I have um, this little painting, little cow pink painting that I did. Um, I believe in pink. Got this from Dollar Tree. No, five and below. This I got Trust Your Journey. This is from Dollar Tree. And then as well, this one is from also Dollar Tree, which is awesome. And then over here is just I hung up my Kappa Delta sorority like certificate from when I got initiated. And on the last shelf, I just have like these Bible verses to like encourage, like it's women encouragement cards. And then my Kappa Delta like pin. And then that's also from Dollar Tree. Then over here on my nightstand, it's kind of dirty, but I just have like my sleeping mask, my AirPods, my 
diffuser, some like Tylenol because I had it over here when I got my second dose vaccine. And then also I got this from my friend Taylor um, for my 21st birthday and I just put her picture in it. I was going to hang it up here but it ended up, sorry, falling so I just kept it right there. Also, this is like an overview of my bed. It is a twin bed and uh, it is small, but obviously like for one person, it does it. My back does sometimes hurt, but I don't have a memory foam under it. So I think when I go to DC, I'm bringing my memory foam. But I have this cheetah blanket that I got for my birthday. Another blanket because it does get cold in here at night. This cover, I believe, is from Target. Um, I have Baby Yoda over here. got that for my birthday. And then I have um, my pillows, my satin pillow. I have like my other satin pillow at home. Just like another small pillow. But yeah, this is just like the overview. Sorry if my bed's like wrinkly. But it's just like an overview of it. I think we got it from the mattress firm when you order it. They ship it to you. And it comes with um, like a, sorry, it's a post-it note. Like this type of frame which is just like very convenient and works out especially like if you have an apartment and because it's easy to fold up and this one like it just works out properly now this is the overview of my closet it is kind of small but i didn't bring a lot of clothes i did but i didn't um i just brought a lot of winter clothes but here i kind of like section out this is about the fall you can see I have an addiction with Zara because this side of my closet, it's literally all Zara. There's some Zara stuff in there, but um, the rest is just like my regular clothes. But I still have a lot of winter. You guys can tell I really like the color like brown, nude, just like the typical staple colors. And then I have this hook. I was originally going to put this in my door, but the door wouldn't close. So I just put it in my closet. I just have my bags, Lululemon bag. So I'm like earmuffs, scarf, and that's pretty much it. Um, on top of here, I just have random stuff like I have my laundry stuff, candles, wipes, some film stuff, this little thing that my friend made for my birthday as well, basket of some other laundry stuff, and then this is kind of messy. But I have some hoodies and sweaters over there. Then over here, just like jeans. Everything falls every time I touch it. Um, jeans, jackets, and whatnot. Off to the corner, you guys can see you. It's my laundry, and then I have my Nespresso bin. I'm probably end up like throwing that away because I don't really need it. Um, then all my shoes, um, a lot of boots, regular shoes, heels, and then over here, I just kept my box, my air humidifier. That every time I clean my room, I just let this go on, and then my suitcase, and then other bags. And right on the side where it's by the door, like by the door I have like my bag, like my spring bag that I'm using right now. And then I have my little tote bags that I use for grocery shopping or if I'm just going to go to the quad on campus, I'll just throw my laptop on there with some books. And then I just have, this is my first painting when I started getting into painting. And so I just hung it right there. I was going to hang up more paintings, but I like added it to my wall. But yeah, that's pretty much it. Okay. So I was editing the intro and outro and I didn't like it. It's just like the quality wasn't good and like the lighting was not good at all. So I just cut it out basically because I just didn't want it to mess up the video. Like whenever I edit, whenever I edit it and stuff, I just want to make sure like the lighting kind of correlates with everything else. So that's why there's no intro or outro. But yeah, so I just wanted to and I include this in the ending just in case you guys were like wondering why I didn't do an outro or intro or anything like that. But don't forget to subscribe. It always means a lot to me. And I'll see you guys later.